Welcome, welcome, welcome everyone. We are back. We're back in something a little bit different. Just a little bit quick sort of flight today. I just want to give this a bit of a test run. I'm actually got a bit of spare time, or should I say I can't sleep, so why not stream? Uh, but I've been wanting to take the B21 Raider for a spin uh, from Hangar Studios, which is available free at the moment from flightsim.to. It's a work in progress, so not everything's done, but uh, let's have a bit of a play around with it, a bit of a flight. Uh, it's probably only going to be about an hour or so. Uh, I'm not going to have the camera on because I've totally haven't even set it up. I just said, nah, I'm just going to stream it. I wanted to make a video on it, so why not stream it uh, and see how we go. I haven't even set my screens up and my cameras up and all that sort of stuff uh, for the flight. So I'm just going to uh, chill out, start her up, take her for the flight. If the, f the flight plan is uh, in the comments below if you want to join along. Uh, but again, quite a... Quite a quick flight, about an hour. Let's see if we can get this thing started up. It's going to be quick. Uh, and let's get straight uh, into it. And uh, yeah, let's go. So yeah, inside still got, it looks okay. It works, things work. We'll actually turn off uh, co-pilot. There we go. Uh, but she, she looks good. Externally, it looks very nice, very smart. It does state that it's not 100%. Uh, He's just used the photos to basically get the model happening. But uh, looks cool. And I've taken it for a little bit of a flight, and it's a bit of fun as well. So let's try to get her started first of all. Check my volumes, and I'm going to turn the music down a little. The uh, probiotics up for now, so I can see what's happening. See the engine's coming up. So we're taking off from Guam, pretty much moving up uh, north. We're going to try to have a bit of fun and land on a 2,000 foot airfield. Hey, <laughs> Stu Legend, how are you, mate? You bloody legend, you. Mate, I just decided, I couldn't sleep, so I said, you know what, I'm going to stream the B-21, mate. Uh, you're welcome, it's going to be a quick flight. Uh, we're at uh, PGUA, we're at Guam, we're just going to take a flight, a couple of islands, uh, called Benjamin, we're going to go, over, then we're going to go to Tinanin, and then we're going to go and try to take this and land it. There he is. Stu with a 20 pound donation, you bloody legend mate. Let's just throw that out in the background for another one. You don't have the B21? Well it's free, you can go grab it. You... Oh, thank you mate. You have a bloody good new year and a Christmas as well. You're an absolute legend mate. Thank you very much mate, much appreciated for that. Uh, but yeah, this is totally not advertised, just I said I'm going to take this thing for a spin. Uh, see if we can fly it, and then we're going to see if we can abs uh, land it on a 2,000 foot runway, grass runway in the middle of nowhere. Uh, so let's uh, get the other engine started up. We'll turn the left. It looks nice. For a free aircraft, you can't complain. Hey, DJ buddy, how you doing? How are you doing, mate? This is a... Yeah, the B-21 Raider. It's available free and I've been wanting to... I had some um, pre-pre-pre-flightsim.to release uh, from uh, B-4 Gunner, the developer. And uh, I didn't get a chance to fly it live or anything, so... Hey, Big Al's in the house, is he as well? There he is! I am up so late, mate. I am up so late. It is uh, 1.41. I couldn't sleep. 
It must be the excitement. Like, you know what? Uh, it must be the excitement. I don't have the camera all set up. Maybe I'll set the camera up in a second. Um, because uh, it was a last minute stream. You're in Goa, mate. You're in Goa. That's awesome, DJ. You're following Stu around the streams. <laughs> uh, all right, this is, we started up now. We started up. Let's get the uh, right generator on. Uh, we get that on. We'll put some. We probably don't need the DI. So I just noticed I don't have live uh, weather on. You know, it's very basic. It, look, to me, it's. It's all right, but this, you know, it's about the looks for this baby. We're going to be flying this one, so let's go and see what I want. To, I think the weather's quite nasty in the area at the moment, so let's have a quick look. Yeah, that, you know, that's what I thought. <laughs> oh, you know what? I'm up for it. Not the weather. Yeah, be cloudy. We'll be right. We'll be right. Um. So why not? Why not take it for a spin? And uh, yeah, Garwin's been flying it. Uh, obviously, Brett's been flying it. Uh, and uh, I just haven't had time to fly it. So I said, stuff it. I can't sleep. I'm excited. Christmas is here. Why not just uh, stream it? Yeah, they did. They did. Uh, is it any good? Well, I flew it just once before the stream. Um, oh, I actually did fly one of the pre-release FlightSim.to releases because uh, the developer gave me a bit of a look-see and yeah, it's fun, it's fun. Only 20% on the game. What do you mean only 20%? Only 20% only on the game? I don't get it. But... Uh, might be the music going up and down. I've, I was throwing some other music on, but I don't think it's any good. But I'm just going to go to what I normally just... Put popular on, play some different music. I don't really like this either, but anyway. 20% off! Something's 20% off, so the bit... Anyway, look, we're going to get in the air. We've got autopilot on this bad boy, so we're going to uh, see if we can go. Oh, I just noticed the, uh, the steering's pretty, pretty bad. Oh no, that's alright, we'll get there, come on, come on, we're going to have to just go and uh, line up. Oh, you mean Mark, the, the title, Microsoft Flight Simulator's 20% off? Oh, on the Steam sale, is it? I've even haven't got my um, screen set up. I'll be looking to the right because normally I move my screen over to the left. Actually, you can't even see me on camera, so it doesn't matter. But I'm looking to my right, which you can't see. Once we get autopilot on, I might plug my camera in. Okay, but uh, I'm struggling to even get this thing turn. Ah, yes, Steam sale. Yeah, this thing's not turning at all. Come on, come on. Come on. This is really, 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 really not turning too well. Oh, Icarus has jumped in. Ah, he's got the B-21 radar as well, you bloody legend. Awesome. I'm uh, definitely... I am struggling to just turn this thing. Even with a break on. Left with come on, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> well I, 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 I thought this was a good place to fly as well. Show of power to certain countries in this area that that uh, we're flying around uh, Guam. Oh that's it. I finally got this thing lined up. So before we take off. So if you did want to join on the flight, obviously even if you don't have the aircraft, but you can pick up the aircraft for free at flightsim.to, the link's down the bottom. Uh, quick flight, basically an hour, uh, depending if we want to go, how much we want to go over speed. Very cloudy, we'll leave it on like this, we can get above the clouds, it might be a bit of fun. Uh, and we're at PGUA. 
B4 Gunner, nothing like a B21 Raider Freeware under everyone's Christmas tree. Merry Christmas, mate! And here he is. The man, the myth, the legend, the developer, right here with us today. Uh, and Icarus is in it as well, which is cool. But let's get in the air. You know what, I never fly externally, let's just fly externally. You know what, give me a sec, I'm going to uh, plug uh, plug in the camera guys. Give me a second. They have to show the real one because I have to deal with that any new nuclear plane has to be shown off to all countries so they showed it to the public. Show of power. Show of power. Oh, is it going to work? Ah, there it is. Cool. Working. There he goes. Oh, oh Icarus has taken off, guys. Check him out. So this uh, military base we're at at the moment, look at it. It's got military planes everywhere. <laughs> Not the vicious. Let's go. Yes, thank you, everyone, for the 11 likes. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I told, I'm having trouble with the steering B4 gunner. Don't know if that's me again. But you can let me know if uh, that's something you're working on. Look at that beast. Ooh, a little bit cloudy. <laughs> See if we can get above this cloud. But it's not looking too nice out there. Work in progress. Of course it is. We know that. I've even written that below, mate. Um, ooh, look at this. Doesn't this look stunning up here? So we've got to pull a Yui. Ah, oh, she's a, she's beautiful. What a what a great job, mate. And can I just say, B4 Gunner, thank you so much for giving this to the community for free. Like, I know, early ac early access, work in progress, beta, alpha, all that sort of stuff. But, uh, thank you. You ha you know, it's your time that went into making this thing. So. Couldn't get it to 50k, at, but that could be me. Ah. 50,000 feet? Is that what you were... Trying to head to. How good is it? Here we go. Oh, yes, two of them in the air. I know, aren't they? How good are they doing this? Like, doing this for the community are just legends. Absolute legends. And if you haven't picked it up, his other aircraft, which is payware, to support someone like. B4 Gunner, who does put out a lot of freeware. Go get the Twin Navion. That is a beautiful aircraft as well. If you want to fly low and slow and check out the sights, he's a beaut. Just downloading it now, Stu. Oh, come on, Stu. Plenty of time. I'll save it. I'm definitely not falling asleep anytime soon. Ah, oh, this, is, this is brilliant. I don't know about fuel, we'll have to maybe load. The first airfield's not too far away. That, that'll that actually be my first landing with it too, so that's gonna be interesting. Well, I got one engine out. Let's have a quick look here. Yeah, it's so true. Some of, some of that payware is bad, isn't it, big old? Absolutely terrible. I've got to, I've been uh, told off by um, uh, Kiffy, who's, who visits the channel a bit, um, that my sound, my mic, and my my video is not synced with synced with my audio, voice audio. So I need to work on that. So sorry about that, guys. Wish me a great Christmas. Well, you know what? Out to you, vicious. Wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Yep, I know the spoil. Oh, that's the landing gear. I know I got the spoilers. Yep, there they are. 
We're going to need that B4 gunner because the last uh, field is only 2,000 feet on the grass on a tiny little island. So that's going to be interesting. And I do know there is autopilot as well, which works beautifully. I'll throw that on now. Just to show everyone that it works like a charm. Oh, a lot of streamers are having the same sort of issues. Oh, cool. Thank you. But yeah, inside. Loving the cockpit. I oh, know we don't, we haven't seen the real thing. We probably won't see the real thing for a very long time. Could be all the people off work online. Yeah, true. We should turn to the right now if we hit the uh, flight plan. Yeah, it is easy peasy. It only took me a couple of seconds to work out how to start it. Are we going to turn to the right or not? We're not going to turn to the right. Ooh, is it not on GPS? That's probably why. There we go. He's on GPS now. That's all it was. Turn it around. There is formation. We'll uh, get it, Chris, there. Maybe B4 Gunner, you might get all access to the real one. Ooh, wouldn't that be nice? B4 Gunner would be having a big grin if he got himself onto that. Get some uh, first class access to the B21. We're at 10,000 feet and we're about to, we're approaching our first island uh which is uh is it rotter rotter rotor rotor island so yeah, yeah sorry i'm turning to the right or well, on yours it'll probably be to the left on your screen uh because my screen i normally move it over here but i've left it on that side because i just wanted to fly this bit I've seen them say they didn't bring this one out of the hangar because of the mistake they made bringing the B2 out of the hangar way back 34 years ago and someone got aerial shots of it. Oh, 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 look at this. Look at this. He's got the shiny beast over there. Look at this. That's nice. Oh, we're gonna cut. We're gonna descend, get ready for a landing. Maybe Stu won't be too far away. <laughs> Icarus is flapping his wings. The flight doesn't have to end here. We can continue flying when he uh, when we get to the end of the flight plan. If I'm not not tired enough. All right, autopilot off. Rapid descent. Where's the airfield? What way is the wind going? Probably coming from the right. And that will be a runway 27. Oh, yeah. Brilliant. Absolutely love it. We're about 295 at the moment. But again, a big shout out to the 12 thumbs up and a big shout out for Stu with the 20 pound donation, mate. You're an absolute bloody legend. And this is me just thinking I'll jump on a stream and fly lonesome uh, and give this little baby a test run.
B4 gunner, what's the stall speed if you're around? You know what? I'm going to do a one of my first outside landings. I never land outside the aircraft. I'm going to be the first one right now. You guys are here to ex see me explode. 140, around 140. Okay. By the way, since it was my uh, first flight, crashes are switched off. G'day, Gumo! How are you, mate? I'm taking the beast for a spin. B21, I'm landing now, I'll come back to you. Yeah, well, you have a you have a bloody Merry Christmas. An awesome Merry Christmas, mate. A good Christmas. Good New Year's. If I don't see you around, coming in pretty fast, though. We're coming in pretty hot. We're coming in pretty hot. We're going to have to slow down. Remember, this is a work in progress aircraft, everyone. Remember. We'll just turn around. There's only a crosswind. And uh, we'll turn around and take off again. Yeah, that wasn't bad for the first uh, real external landing that I've done. You're in the middle of a blizzard? That's no good at all. I don't think we'll have a problem landing on, two, on that small island with a 2,000 foot. Just as long as there's no trees, I guess, and it's very narrow, we'll be okay. Alright, let's turn around. Oh, why aren't I, uh... Something's going on. What's going on? Hey, everything's switched off. Hey! Work in progress, everyone. How much fuel have I got? Got fuel? Got fuel? Fuel? Oh no! Got APU on? Okay. Interesting. I guess that this will use two F-35 engines to power on. Well... We totally... Engines totally died. Everything totally died. Hmm, that's very interesting, isn't it? Any ideas, B4? APU's not switching on. Oh, wait. What? Oh, no, that's uh, Icarus's engines. Forty percent fuel, all good. But we have no battery. No good at all. Let's do if the old uh, cheat works. The old cheat works. The old cheat works. That's all right. The control E worked. Just the buttons didn't work. We're good to go. All good, B4. Just like that runway that's got a piece of grass growing in the middle of it. All right, we'll wait for the engines to start up. We've got one engine up. Let's see if the other engine's coming up now. Yeah, that's it. Control E does the job whenever, whenever in doubt. We'll go catch up to Icarus. And now we're heading off to uh, Tinian. So PGWT, which isn't too far away. And then we'll just, uh, and then it's another small trip to uh, Saipan where the US of A is building a, another mil uh, military airfield there, I think. New one, I think they started this year. I don't know if it's finished. Could be the way they turn the real one as well. Who knows? Got green. Got greenway. Yeah, <laughs> got a greenway. Yeah. <laughs> Stew your classic. Alright, we got both engines up yet. 
yet. Nearly. Nearly. Engine uh, 2 is not, not up yet. We are up now. That was so smooth, that landing. It was really nice. Alright, let's see if we can... Uh, Break on and off to get this to turn into around. Otherwise, I'll use pushback. I've seen on the TV show, forgot the password and couldn't power on the F-35 without it, so just in the sim, it happens. Here we go. We're just going to take off. Let's get out of here. That's it. Let's speed up. Next airfield, remind me to refuel. I flew this from the Ukraine to Moscow earlier, attracted a lot of MiGs flying. <laughs> I was going to do that. Um, I was thinking of where should I fly it. So I thought I was going to do somewhere around the Ukraine. Uh, or uh, until you get the steering fixed, is to hold it around 35% power and play with the brake differential. That's what I was doing then. I was playing with the differential. I wasn't at 35. Or else, or I'd show a bit of uh, power in the uh, oceans just south of uh, China. But yeah. Got to turn my gamer tag off. <laughs> Icarus, you see my MiG SU-35? Where were you? Where were you, Stu? You in the, are you in now or is that on another flight? Stu, I can't see you in at the moment. I like this livery too, P4. It's very nice. Very nice indeed. See two of them scrambling. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's it. It's all over for you with uh, with your game attack. Expect your YouTube account to get hacked. Expect uh, all your emails to get hacked. Oh, I got some issues with my bit of buffering going on. Oh, I'm over speed. Let me just slow down a little. There is a rumor that Oz might buy a few of these. Gosh. We'll have to sell quite a few uh, stiddies <laughs> to buy a few there. <laughs> to sell a few of our islands. Maybe we'll sell uh, Norfolk Island and... Don't tell Brett, but Brett plays. Maybe we'll sell Tasmania <laughs> to buy a few. I'll go back with a flock of these B-21s. <laughs> Home is the original F-117 Stealth. They have blue prototype. Right, just slowing her down a bit because we're quite fast. They are the cheapest bombers yet ever made. Really? Look at that inverted Icarus. Look at him. What a star. No wonder those MiGs were scrambling when you went by over U Ukraine to Moscow. Very, very, I'm going to say it, sexy looking aircraft.
The biggest uh, leg we're going to have is uh, pretty much from Saipan, flying over a couple of little islands and then up to Pagan Island, which has that dirt strip on it. Or grass strip, I should say. 35% fuel. We'll be refueling next stop. Is that the like super shiny? It is the shiny, the shiny. Uh, you, you West USA. Yes, we are. Uh, I will just confirm that. From the ugly duck in, duckling came here to the slick machine. Wait until you see what I have in the works. <laughs> oh, there he goes. b 4 has got something he's working on. Project X. Uh, Stu, let me just double check, but I sure am. Yep, I'm on west. So you're in, but I can't see you. Oh, whoa, 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 we gotta, we gotta descend, guys. Oh no, this is the island before we went to the city. You're in the sky. Hmm, he's in the sky. Come on, Stu. Can you see me? Oh, can you see me, Stu? Can you see Icarus? Well, over the ocean, it becomes quite um, invisible. Quite hard to see. Obviously up close, but if you were quite far away, that would be quite hard to see. I'm in the sky. Who's in the sky? You're not in the sky. But you can't see... Oh, no, you are in the sky, but you can't see me. Hmm. Maybe when I land on refuel, I will uh, switch my aircraft on and off. Let me uh, turn autopilot off. And again, we're going to come in from, I'm guessing that's about a 2.6, yeah. Land in a PGWT, the international airport here. Penny and below, where the US delivered the H bomb. We got some boats down there. So this is the place, Nicholas. infamous place. So I'm guessing that airfield on the other end of the runway was one of the original airfields. The reflection on the mirror live was really something else. I called it the flying ants with the sunlight technology. Awesome. 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 I was going to take it for a spin, but I like this one. So I took this one for a spin. Ah, oh, there's Stu. Got you, Stu. I got you in the air, in the radar, buddy.
So we're doing the big Christmas uh, thing at my place, so it's busy cleaning up the uh, our very small yard that we have for the visitors today, and I'll probably continue tomorrow. Well, continue today because it's 2 a.m., so I'll continue when I go to bed and wake up. Yeah, got a visual. That's it. He's up. Coming into land here, Stu, I'm only on 30% gas. Need a re refuel. Because we'll probably need, won't refuel until we get to our final destination, which is quite far from here. Depends if we go over speed or not. I will try another external landing. Funny how the, the wing was first thought. Yeah. No, the wing was first thought before that. The Germans were going to... Uh, I don't know if you ever saw the the German version. In they had a concept. Whoa, we came in way too fast. That's cool. Look at that. That wasn't too bad at all. Alright, because it's too it's too hard to turn to go and taxi, I'm just going to go to the end. Just a crosswind will take off again. I'll just refuel at the other end. I'm sure I saw this, uh, not obviously, World War II concept was not about radar absorption. That was just a concept they had for an aircraft. Good structure. How do you like it, Stu? Not too bad, is it? Got a few downloads of it as well, I noticed on flightsim.to. Oh, I can see the radar absorption. All right, we're gonna try to see if we can get this. Turn, that's it. Stop, turn, 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 turn. All right, we'll push back. Hey, wrong way, wrong way, that way. Oh, you're not gonna do that? There we go. It is fun, isn't it? It is nice, fun aircraft, I like it. Very nice, and for, you can't complain when it's, uh, free either. But he's done such a bloody good job. Oh, I don't want to hit your wing. Try to get it. We'll see Stu's coming in to land here. Oh. Uh, Stu, here he comes. He's coming in. Can we see? Sorry, guys. Camera's all over the place. Here he is. Oh, Stu! He's taxing up. I've got to refuel, don't I? Oh, not the weather. Ooh, ooh, that's a lot of fuel. Yes.
the two beasts and a third beast coming up. Very cool. Genius James, hello, hello. How are you? It's only an early uh, 20 past 2 a.m. in the morning for me. <laughs> Alien technology, exactly right. He's still got the digital livery, look at that. Ammo. I'm doing absolutely amazing, mate. Absolutely amazing. Check out, let's get the uh, external camera here. Oh. Before we take off, because we're going to fly over uh, Saipan and then we're going up to our real tiny airfield up north. Look at this. Look at that. That looks absolutely cool. Alright. Let's, uh, let's get in the air. Huh? Go. Oh, I gotta watch my steering. Gotta watch my steering. Gotta watch my steering. I lost one engine. I might have lost one engine here, guys. We'll have a look around here. Oh, you know why? All the fuel I put in it killed me. Awesome. Oh, we got music. We're Christmas music. Look at that. That's Saipan ahead of us. Is that stuttering on your end, guys, or is it all right? On mine's totally perfect, but is it a bit stutter on your side? Looks like uh, dropping some frames on the stream only. We're not landing at this one, we're just uh, Saipan International. All good there, cool. Everything looking good, let's do a flyby. We can do fly past the tower here, Top Gun style. Where is the tower? Is that over there on the right? Right. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Stu buzzed the tower as well. <laughs> nice. Ah, oh, look at that. That's awesome. Actually, isn't there a radar tower on this? An abandoned radar tower? Tell this is Ghost Rider requesting a flyby. <laughs> Sure, there's an abandoned radar tower on this uh, island. Might be up ahead here. Let's see if we can find the uh, radar tower. It's abandoned. I'm sure there is. No. 
Maybe it's another island. Oh, here it is. That there is. This is it. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Abandoned radar tower. Yeah. Ooh, we're gonna stall this. Ooh, nah. Yep, yep. This is nasty, guys. Come on, get some speed back. There we go. Alright, we'll continue the flight plan. We've got a bit of a long leg ahead of us to our final destination. It so does. So wants to fly, but yeah, we'll see. We'll, I'll get a better view, and I can uh, get those. There you go. That looks so cool. Oh, it's actually scenery over there on the side of the hill. I stalled it a few times at forty thousand and above, but it comes back. Yeah. Nose down. We'll get some altitude here. We'll throw it back on autopilot. For our long little... Uh, uh, long leg. What do we got? Well, not very long if we got over speed. Go back to 10,000. This is, uh, I'm going to just put this, put this one up here. This is uh, for B4 Gunner. Uh, an absolute legend. I'm going to throw this one up. Mate, this is, that's for you. Designing again this aircraft. Throwing it out there for free for Christmas for the folks. Uh, for us. And uh, if you haven't already supported him, go buy this twin Navion and support him because... The bloody legend and he's already hinted he's got something in the works that uh, is going to be pretty cool <laughs> you know you're probably right that would be pretty funny though if uh, if uh, some of those uh, aircraft were leaked imagine they did use MS Microsoft Flight Sim for a uh, tested aircraft and a whole lot of those aircraft got leaked or got hacked and then went out that would be pretty pretty funny billions of millions and millions and billions of work to design the aircraft thrown out the window yeah genius James so true uh, absolutely uh, Twin Navion is a, that's another aircraft that is so stable. I know a lot of those sort of aircraft seem tend to be, but that flies like a dream. And that can land on a dime as well. That thing's pretty cool. Sneaky Stew's going low. He's going to go low. Try to get under radar. True. Yeah, uh, that, that would test him in all sorts of secret locations. Can land on its own unless James is behind the yoke. <laughs> hey, mate, I've seen some of your landings. Not many people could pull those sort of landings off, James. <laughs> There's only one genius, James. James landing, and you got to be you got you got to be positive. It's the perfect landing.
Actually amazed there's not many ships around here because I've got the uh, seafront simulations and you'd think there'd be a few ships around here but it might not be working. I know it bugs out sometimes. <laughs> Who's behind me? I did impress Gala by successfully landing a 787. Nice. Good job. Still, I haven't flown any of the airliners very much at all. Not much at all. So, I would not be very good at landing them. Slow it down a bit. We're going a bit, probably over speed. Let's have a look inside. Oh no. Stu's harassing Icarus. Genie's dreams. I keep away from the big planes too. Many buttons on them. <laughs> It's like, I just like, I don't mind the jets and fighters because they're they you, you know your fighter aircraft jets fast things military they you know I'm a fan of all that stuff but um, obviously GA fan what is in the works makes this plane look obsolete it's really an aircraft prototype that never came to fruitate ooh or is it least that we know of think the F117A on steroids with F-22-35 Tomcat Hybrid. Ooh, Tomcat Hybrid. Stu, did you hear that? A cross between an F-117, F-22 and an F-35 and a Tomcat. That's going to be Stu's dream plane. Stu's going to be... Oh, you got to let Stu test that out. Stu is your test pilot for that aircraft. Anatan, Anatahan, Anatahan, is this, this uh, island we're coming up to? There's absolutely no way to, nowhere to land on this island. Unless we throw some floats on the uh, B-21. So we're doing a couple of island hops before we get to where we want to get to. Pagan Airstrip. Do go, yep, I'll take it. Who's testing up testing it out up there is doing a couple of some sharp turns. Been one of the ex US Navy guys saying he wished they had built a super Tomcat. Icarus, just good as me in the Tomcat. Is it Icarus's favorite as well? The super Tomcat. Yeah, I think Shu sent me a couple of pictures of what that would look like, and it did look bloody good. I already have it about 90% complete. I've been working on this for over a year. In a time comparison, I did the radar in under three weeks. That's insane. But I'm glad you did the, the radar. I'm, thank you again. I'll definitely be flying this again in a stream or two. All I need is a couple of uh, wombats uh, on the wings there, and uh, she'll be perfect. <laughs> I've got to learn to do my own liveries. Oh, looks like we don't have very good uh, satellite imagery for this island.
volcanic island as you can see. Definitely couldn't put a, a runway on this island. Put something very short down this end. But to get, they'll have to somehow airdrop it in all the equipment. Because uh, there's nowhere to dock a boat or a ship. An aeronautic star. Here they are, they've caught up. They've slowed it down a bit. That's so cool. Who would have thought that we'd all be flying the B-21 before Christmas, huh? And I'll be flying at 2.33 a.m. in the morning. Made deliveries easy, awesome. B4 gunner got pick off the Super Tomcat. So the next uh, volcanic island is Saragin, Saragin, and then uh, there'll be Alamagin, Alamagin. And then we'll get to our uh, landing. Consider flying the B-21 on a stream this evening after work. Just booting up the Microsoft Flight Simulator now to figure out the flight plan. Awesome. Awesome. Well, we'll see how I go waking up. Might be able to catch it. But I probably won't be able to fly it. So I'll be doing some work to still prep the house for our visitors. We do a Christmas, uh, we do two, we do a Christmas Eve gathering, which is at my place, and then Christmas Day we do another family gathering at somebody else's place. So, it's a busy few days for me. Just join my Discord, it's in there. Stu, we love the Tomcat. Stone cold killing machine of its day. We sure do. So in um, the latest Top Gun movie, did you guys all celebrate when they uh, grabbed that old Tomcat? Did everyone just celebrate and all the memories came back? But when you th uh, th uh, first saw a Tomcat, and you just said, that's my plane. Oh, island time. Again, not putting an airstrip on this one. Don't have exterior lights, you actually made me feel old. <laughs> Hard to start in one battle, start up in one. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Cold startup. Very old. Yeah, was an old one. Remember, things were falling off it. <laughs> Pretty cool, though. I guess they had to revisit it. If, it. if they didn't revisit it, people probably would have got a bit upset if they didn't have an F-14 in there somewhere. Thank you, everyone, for the 14 likes, legends. Thank you so much. 
And uh, thanks for everybody watching at the moment. You're all legends. We're flying the B-21 uh, Northrop Grumman of B-21 Raider. Uh, it is a freeware aircraft available at uh, flightsim.to by Hangar Studios 713. Go grab it and go bloody enjoy it. And uh, if you're in chat or you're watching and you're not chatting, throw out a big thank you to B4 Gunner. He's the developer. He's in chat. So uh, it's all because of him you got this present. It's all about the onboard computers now. Flying the fighters are not really pilots anymore. That's right. Probably won't be in my lifetime, but it's still not uh, far away when most things like this will be all... Well, they'll be basically drones, won't they? They've thought of making this the B-21 UAV, but the brass didn't want a nuclear plane to be a UAV. That's fair enough. You know what? It'll What'll happen, uh, Big Al, is another country will do it, and then the US will have no, no choice. China, Russia, who knows, India. One of them will just say, nah, we'll do it. And the, and the US, obviously, knowing what can happen if drones obviously carry nuclear weapons, don't want to have them carrying it, will have no choice but to make one. Where some of those countries' safety records isn't a priority, uh, and they'll just get it done. But also finance, you know, it costs a lot to uh, train a pilot. Where to program a computer doesn't cost much at all. Program a computer or have a, a ground based pilot. Flying a, a remote control panel. Skynet lets you think you are flying, but really it's a machine. Break out with the Terminator. Da, da, da. <laughs> uh, actually, that's a soundboard I don't have. I don't have any Terminator uh, soundboard, but well, we've got another island here, but I don't think it's, it's got no name. Oh yeah, Goo Gooin. This is this actually looks cool if it if it's done well. In here. Uh, the uh, satellite imagery is very poor. Another shout out to B4 Gunner, legend, he's on the screen now, the legend, the one that says thank you. Stu will be back. I will be back. Thought we got this Christmas music on again. Yeah, probably about right. Oh, actually, here's the island. We're nearly here. You can actually see it. That island in the far distance is where we're landing. Oh. No, it's not. No, it's not. There's one more. That's uh, Alamagin. Alamagin. We've got one more uh, flight over that, and then we're there. Will be the day AI becomes self-aware. Forget about it. B4, B5, B6, who knows? Gooch, there's Viper. Three o'clock low. Stay with Hollywood, Mav. We're his cover. Don't you leave me, Maverick. Hollywood, you look good. I'm going after Viper. Icarus is at six, though. <laughs> have I got, I've got two. Don't I have two Top Gun? I have... Oh, it's Icarus has got one. That's right. Icarus's name is one. I thought I had another one. 
Was it a carrier? Was it the carrier one? Let me see. Any of you boys seen an aircraft carrier around here? Should have put some uh, aircraft carrier mods on. Icarus going for a flyby of the island. Yeah, would be absolutely cool. Gee, we're gonna go and fly on the. We're gonna do what Icarus is doing on the next island. Gonna go low. Do some low flying. Big Al's flat. We are already there. Search YouTube for AI computer. They had to shut it down. I literally said it had to destroy the human race to become superior. That's nuts. That's insane. Absolutely insane. what not in the sim but I'd like to see one of these things do a, a belly water landing interesting Julian Wolf this is the brand new b17 flying fortress see those holes at the back that's where there's multiple tail gunners yeah how <laughs> my <A> thousand day. <laughs> uh, again, something like that. Another volcano. on uh, that. You guys are probably not on like 80% fuel like me. This is a place to come to buy an island for evil. <laughs> Super lair, yeah, that's it. Oh, there, now we can see the island we're heading to. We can see it now. Go in the wrong direction, folks. See, now you can see how Icarus's aircraft could, without the sun reflecting of it, actually blends quite well into the ocean. So pretty much along here, you've got a whole lot of little island hops. And eventually, if you follow all the little islands, you get to Iwo Jima. The problem is, I was going to fly there in this flight, but it doesn't have an airfield that comes up on the sim. There's an airfield there, it must be not active. No idea. Someone can Google it for me. There's definitely an airfield there, because that obviously had a World War II airfield on there. Well, it's sleeping music, but it mustn't be an active air airport. Oh, 
Well, we're about to find out. This is a 2,000 foot grass runway that's coming up. Did I see a slew? Nah, I wouldn't be able to take off from a carrier. Maybe on a light load of fuel. Around the world in a World War II warbird, I like the P-51 Mustang. True, we could do something. I could do something like that. They do have a mirrored prototype for the Nighthawk the F th and the F-35. Picture was leaked. I best be heading off. Got to get ready for work. Enjoy the flight. No problems, legend. Thanks for dropping by, Genius James. I much appreciate it. And again, thank you to everyone who smashed those 15 likes as the sleeping music. It's trying to tell me something. Uh, it's oh, got someone just up here. Equals. In formation flying here. There we go. Look at that for a shot. Oh, now Icarus wants to speed up. This is going to be fun. Ready for a laugh, everyone? Here we go. This is going to be it. The small air field here and it's grass I don't know how rough it is I did not scope it before uh yeah I, I enjoy I enjoy staying up like I know I, I'm lucky I don't have to work early tomorrow but tomorrow today I should say shouldn't I I'm gonna do a flyby first just to scope this out uh but uh yeah I can get away with maybe five five hours sleep and I tend to be still pretty productive. I know it's not healthy to do it often, but I'm pretty productive in about five hours and can wake up no problems. Oh, it's over here. Sorry, I thought it was going to be between those mountains over there. We got 22 knots of wing. And it'll be a crosswind too. This thing's gonna be small. Yeah, there it is. Oh, this is going to be fun. That's it. Wow. This is going to be fun. I think I'm coming from the ocean side, though. Looks great, Gary. Thanks for showing it off. Merry Christmas. Thank you, B4 legend. No problems. It's, uh, this is all because of you. I wouldn't be flying it. I wouldn't be doing this stream. I was excited to fly it. I had the spare time to stream it. So I said, why not? Because I couldn't sleep. Otherwise, I would have streamed it on my normal stream on uh, my Monday morning, which would have been a lot of your Christmas e Christmas Day Eve. Alright, let's go. See if we can get this baby down. Yeah, B4 deserves a massive Christmas for giving this to us. The landing gear looks... Even the landing gear coming out. The detail. I love it. Got to zoom in my... Uh, hopefully this will be not crash. Boxing Day, that's the one. Who knows all about Boxing Day? Oh, I've come in a bit wide here. Alright, we're at 200 knots. 
Come on, slow it down faster. It's going to be fun. It's going to be we've got trees ahead of us. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Don't worry about the building. Yes. Easy done. And we got runway to spare. I am just going to, uh, that is awesome. All right, we're going to get up here. We're going to quickly get out and watch these boys going. Where are we? Let's go. Better just put my uh, parking brake on. Icarus's turn. Would, man, would we have a problem landing a Cessna 152 on it? See you later on the next stream. Gotta go. Shower now. No problems. St. Stephen's Day at Shu for the Irish anyway. Full breaks. Here we go. Icarus's turn. Nice and steady, Icarus. Very nicely done. Good job. Alright, Stu. You wanna have a go? We're waiting for you now. Here he comes. There, yeah, just park there. It's too hard to turn. <laughs> Icarus. Especially in this uh, heavily forested area. It lands like a C-130. It's pretty solid. Do you know what? I was that was it. I was very low speeds and um, coming in. I thought I actually lost enough for lift, but uh, it was perfect. Stu's coming in 100 miles. Absolutely smashing it through. Nah, he's going for a flyby. <laughs> he's gonna wire it. Are you? <laughs> You're a legend, Stu. I love your work. Yeah. Nah, she's really nice to on it comes down very nicely you hit the tree that bloody tree look at that reflection stew stuck in the tree all right guys i'll leave it uh i'll leave it there stew um this is another shout out to you stew uh because that 20 pound donation mate thank you sir uh again you absolutely amazing supporter of the channel and many other channels but uh for me this absolutely and you're always there so thank you so much uh icarus thanks a lot for flying along as well absolutely legend uh big al great to chat with you mate like always uh absolutely legendary chatting with you b4 gunner what can i say b4 gunner uh, you've uh, made a brilliant free aircraft for us all to play with uh, and fly. So thank you, and we'll all enjoy many, many more hours of fun in it. Uh, and thank you for coming along and chatting with us. And we're looking forward to your next project. Uh, Julian Wolf, thank you as well for dropping in. DJ at the start was there. Genius James, you're all legends. Uh, and again, a big thank you to all of you. But uh, I definitely is time to go to bed. So I've got a big few days ahead like a lot of you probably do. Uh, and uh, again, thank you all. Absolute legends. Merry Christmas to every one of you guys in chat there today. Thank you guys. Uh, absolute legend. Legends. Uh, we'll throw up the wombat. He doesn't have the uh, Santa hat on, but he's still there. But enjoy. Hopefully I'll uh, be back with not too much of a hangover <laughs> on uh, Boxing Day Aussie time or Christmas Day Eve for you guys. I've got to put a flight plan together. Last minute. See you, legends.